What's up? Welcome back. Thanks for tuning in. I hope you guys are doing well. This week we're going to check out some footage from Jurassic Lake in Argentina. We got to go down and mouse. We got some super cool eats. We're going to analyze that footage and talk about some of the basic do's and don'ts to help you guys catch more fish on mice. And we got to watch some super sick slow-mo mouse eats, so check it out. Release shot. <laughs> Good job. One of the most common mistakes that I see when people are fishing mice is setting the hook too early. A fish comes up, swipes at the fly, and people set the hook. The problem with that is fish oftentimes miss the fly, especially when they're eating a mouse and especially at night. So what you want to do is keep stripping in that same fashion and it takes some nerves of steel, but you want to keep stripping and that fish will often come back twice, three, four, five times until it gets the fly. Once the fish eats the fly, you just strip set and if it by chance pulls out of its mouth or doesn't set properly, fish will oftentimes whirl around and try and eat it again. So just keep stripping no matter what until you feel the weight of that fish, then strip set into them and after you have them on, then you can raise your rod tip. If you trout set, you're gonna pull the fly out of play and oftentimes those fish will lose interest. Let's watch that again. Here's a good example of what not to do. The fish comes up and eats and just a knee jerk reaction, he sets the hook and pulls the fly out of play. If he would have waited just a split second and kept stripping, then the fish might have come back and eaten it a second time. Here's a really good example of what to do. The fish comes up, tries to eat the fly and he just continues stripping the fly. Here's a perfect example of what to do. At this point, his mouse had actually sunk a little bit, so it's just an inch or so underneath the surface. But as he's stripping, the fish comes up and eats. He strips, feels the weight of the fish, sets into it, and then after the fish is on, he raises his rod tip to fight the fish. Game on, fish in the net. Zach showing nerves of steel right here. The fish comes up, eats, and he stops, doesn't do anything, then gives it a slow movement to try and get the fish interested again. Yeah, we both both know that you know we've been no no go on the low. You can see here the fish misses the fly and just again that knee jerk reaction is to trout set the hook pulls it out of play however if you make this mistake try and get that fly back into the water as quickly as possible oftentimes that splat of the fly hitting the water and then the first few strips are going to be enough that if that fish is still interested he'll come back and grab it again yeah tell me that Tell me you ain't got the feeling Tell me you ain't really feeling You ain't nobody You ain't nobody Switch it up, it's been enough Same old, same old little stuff Don't want too many messing up You can see here as we play it in slow-mo That he strips into the fish first Feels the way he's connected Then lifts his rod And that's exactly how you want to do it Yeah, we both both know that you know, we've been no no go 
on the low This that for for sure That we gone off bro Yeah you know What 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 you know Yeah Give me a reason and I won't leave Then time after time we've been going off mine Ain't no meaning without you I'm reaching for more time Yeah, more, more time Yeah, one more time Yeah, don't you lie You've been doing a lot You've been doing so much Somehow you've been so fine Then you living a lie Cause I know, and you know, yeah Yeah, we both both know, that you know We been no no go, on the low This that for for sure, that we gone off bro Yeah, you know, what you know, what you know What you know, what you know what you know, what you know, what you know Hopefully you guys learned something and had a good time watching the video. If you haven't subscribed yet, eh, whatever, do it if you want. And we'll see you next week.